channel. So today I am here with four if new hair tutorials. One is this super cute how to get fake short hair. Did I say fake? I'm really, really excited about this. A lot of people on Instagram were like, Ali, did you cut your hair? I actually did it. But a lot of these hair tutorials I really, really love. And I have a lot of, I had a lot of fun with this video. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you do, definitely go right ahead and give it a big old thumbs up. Let's see if we can get this video to 300 likes. So be sure to share it with your friends. And if you enjoy it, comment, like, and all that good stuff. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys millions. Hope you enjoy. you want me for these hair tutorials are not that many things but first off you just need a little hair clip like this this is actually optional some little rubber bands are a must a actual larger rubber band is a must as well and a hairbrush so you can get all those knots out of your hair and that's all that you need so let's get started All right, so first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go right ahead and brush out my hair. I have my hair straightened. I have naturally curly hair, but I always wear my hair straightened. I just really like it that way. So for this first hairstyle, it's going to be a braided type thing that's in the middle of your head. And that was one of the hairstyles that you saw in the beginning. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to section off my hair. And I'm going to go ahead and put that in a low ponytail. I'm just pulling out a section of my hair just so then it's straight edged on the crown of my head in a way, like a straight line. And then I'm gonna start French braiding it backwards. It's really hard to explain, but it's really self-explanatory, so I hope the video helps you. But I'm just gonna French braid it. You want it to be a small, really, really small French braid in the front, so you're gonna grab not that much hair to start out the French braid. Um, so you're just gonna go right ahead and braid it back, but don't grab pieces from the side that you like put into the ponytail. You're just gonna leave those in the ponytail, and the hair that you sectioned off is the only hair that you are going to grab, so. Yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and do that. So once you get to the bottom of your hair, what you're going to do is you're just going to go ahead and braid it all the way down without pulling any more hair, and then just tie it off with a hair tie. And there you have it. You have this really, really adorable French braid. I just love it because it takes your hair off your face, but gives you this really, really fun look that isn't like a normal French braid, but it's just, I just love the way it looks. And I just went ahead and took a hair clip and pulled back the front pieces as well, and then clipped it in the back like so. And you can either leave the front pieces down and let them hang in your face, or you can pull it back with a clip like that. It's totally up to you, but this hairstyle is just super fun, flirty, and perfect for spring. So moving on to the next hairstyle, this one's pretty, pretty simple. It's, I'm sure y'all know how to do it, but I just thought I would throw it in here just because I've been loving to wear my hair like this. And I actually saw somebody on The Bachelor wear their hair like this. I think, was it Jordan? I'm, I'm not completely sure, but I've been obsessed with that show. But I saw her wear her hair like this. I was like, that looks so cute. I have to try it out. So I went and tried it out. And ever since then, I've been loving it. So what you do is you section off a little piece of your hair in the front as well, like before. But instead of braiding it back and pulling back your other hair, you're just gonna go right ahead and put it in a little tie like this I feel like this makes me look like a little shih tzu in a way like you know how like dogs wear their hair like this But I also think it looks super cute and fun and flirty and it really looked good with my outfit that day, too So I was really really obsessed with it. So it's really simple, but it also gives you a new look to just straight hair or curl hair either way hairstyle is we don't want none unless you got bones huh <laughs> this next hairstyle is all about the bun i absolutely love this one it's so much 
fun to do. I just love it. So what you do is you pull your hair back into a ponytail, which I'm sure y'all know how to do. And then you go ahead and tie it with your good old handy hair tie. You want to make sure that it's tight in your head. And then my camera stopped recording at this part. But what I did was I went ahead and took my hair and made it into a little bun. You know how you pull it through the rubber band, but don't pull it all the way through so it turns into a ponytail? You just leave it that way. And you leave the little piece hanging out. And then what you do is you go ahead and you take a piece of the hair that's hanging out and wrap it about around the bun like this and this is gonna make the bun stick out and make it look super fun and just I love the way it looks and I just feel like it adds something fun to taking your hair off your face and to a normal bun and I really really liked it so I thought I would share it with you guys hairstyle tip time so I know how I told you guys how I told you guys I was gonna tell you how I made my hair shorter in the beginning and I thought that this would be fun because if you have longer or not longer hair like me like I don't really have that long hair but if you have like medium length hair like me and you want a change why not go ahead and see a way that you can make it short without the permanent change so what I do is I make my hair into a high ponytail like just like this and then so bad right now. I was just like, what the heck is that? Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm gonna pass out. Okay, that was a cat. Then what Allie does is get scared by a cat. <laughs> but once you have your hair up in a high ponytail, then what you're gonna do is you're just gonna go ahead and take a hat like this and literally put it over your hair and boom, you have instantly short hair. It's so much fun and it's funny because a lot of people are like, you don't look like yourself like that. When really it's just a change and I really really love it and it's super fun and I just really enjoy it have been enjoying making my hair look like different lengths lately so I really hope that you guys enjoyed learning how I do so <laughs> Bop. let me know you wop 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 okay that was weird so I really hope that you guys enjoyed. be sure to give this video a big old thumbs up I want to see if we can get this video to 300 likes it means so much to me and I would love you guys so much, I mean like I already love you guys so much, but if you give this video a big old thumbs up, share with your friends, get the 300 likes, and so thank much you so much for watching. Be sure to smile, because you know, without smiling, this world will be boring, and we don't want it to be boring, so smile. Thank you so much for watching, hope you're having a great day!